The initial install of the DC-1 into our truck was very, very easy. I think it took our team 20 minutes to get it up and going. That included mounting it into the racks. So the, the DC-1 is just a phenomenal equipment that you can just plug and play. Our decision to go with the DC-1, there was a few factors. Reason one is our relationship with eBirds. They've always been phenomenal with us. The success of Dreamcatcher can directly be attributed to our partnership with our customers. The people who are going to use your system day in and day out are the people who have the best insight to what makes your system better. Three, two, one, go, go. The service and support from Eberts is far beyond anything we've ever had before. It's like a family. We've always prided ourselves on creating a very intimate service experience for our customers. The people who are installing your equipment, the people who are training your staff are the same people you call when you have questions. You know them by name, they know you by name. We almost feel like they're a family and part of our family when we're calling them and servicing them. My best example of a time when service was beyond above and beyond, we had a problem with one of the gear and it was way past end of life. The Evert support team literally scoured the planet and found this piece somewhere in Japan somewhere and got it to us. A second reason would be the price point of the DC-1, which is really phenomenal in my opinion. And the third and maybe the biggest, we're able to enter the Dreamcatcher environment with the ability to scale up with minor changes. It's not a whole new box. It's not a whole new controller. It's not a whole new learning curve. You're using the software in a scaled back capacity, but the ability to grow as you grow, the product will grow with you. Bar none, my top reason for, for going with, with ZC1. Brandon Sajin with a steal on the back pass towards Broussard. Sajin, ah! star short handed. One of the beautiful things about the Dreamcatcher is that it's constantly recording in our setup all six inputs at the same time. So you can be racking up an angle on one of your inputs and it's doing it across the whole board. Okay, all right, good. Now get me 34 white. There's no turnaround time, there's no waiting. Sometimes my replay operator will have a replay ready before the play is done because of that constant record. The DC-1 is unbelievably user-friendly. It's a point-and-touch generation now, and DC-1 has really adapted to the touchscreen, almost tablet-esque technology wave we're in right now. The Dreamcatcher caters to the next generation while still providing a practical application for the previous generation. Gold, come out. Silver. One of the best parts about the Dreamcatcher on a whole is it's not just a replay system. We actually use it as our primary playback system. With the DC-1, you can import and export very easily off this system. We use it as a server during our OHL coverage. Our opening always comes off that. And then at the end of a game, it's unbelievably easy to get my all angles melt off the system. It's drag and drop to a hard drive, you bring it into the edit suite. We're talking a fraction of the time of what it used to be. Being with Dreamcatcher since day one, I love where it's developed to the point where it's at right now. I love to see where it's going. We're always trying to push the limits in our production values. Producers keep asking for more and more element coming out of the Dreamcatcher. So when we purchase it, we do understand and are willing to move forward. And the expandability is unbelievable. And the support that we would get from Everts for that upgrade, I think would be unsurpassed by any manufacturer. The reason why customers like Cable 14 love the DC-1, it's because it's a first step into the Dreamcatcher platform. It's going to give you all the essential features and tools for running a streamlined production, but allows you to upgrade the system and grow with your production. The DC-1 can be upgraded to a full Dreamcatcher supporting SMPTE 2110, 1080p HDR, and even 4K. This is the next wave. It's not a coming up, it's a there now. It's a phenomenal product and I can't say much more about it than that, it's amazing.